According to Gartner, by 2020, there will be a quarter of a billion connected vehicles on the roads, enabling new in-vehicle services and automated driving capabilities. The challenges surrounding the security of sensitive data payloads are significant, particularly where platform as a service providers are utilized for data aggregation or analytics. Using traditional security methods such as transport layer security, data is often vulnerable to attack or exposure throughout its life cycle. Device Authority's data-centric approach persists the security around the data itself, delivering integrity and trust to the journey of all IoT data without disrupting any existing business processes. Here's how we do it in an automotive scenario. Let's start off by authenticating the car. Advanced dynamic keys generated from properties within the hardware subsystem create a digital DNA mapping that is unique to that vehicle. If there's a match between the car's digital DNA and the device authority authentication service, we can assure the identity of the vehicle. Let's start to create some data. Telemetry information such as the condition of the brake pads or engine oil levels combined with insurance data coming out of a pay-as-you-drive insurance module, for example, average speed readings, to form a data payload that will be transmitted onto the IoT network for consumption by downstream applications. Before being transmitted down the off-ramp onto the untrusted network, Device Authority will process the data payload and, through predefined policies, apply key-based encryption to the data fields themselves. In comparison to traditional methods of data transfer, where data can be exposed and vulnerable to attack, Device Authority's solution ensures that the data remains secure at all times. In this example, the MQTT broker in the cloud subscribes to the vehicle's MQTT topic and is responsible for aggregating all of these secure data payloads, not from just this vehicle, but simultaneously for many others as well. It is commonly known that MQTT brokers lack strong security measures, increasing the size of attack services for data extraction and manipulation. However, with a device authority solution, the data remains secure at all times. From the broker in the cloud, the data then travels onto an Internet of Things platform. Here, the attack surfaces for traditional data flows are, again, substantial and provide huge opportunities for attacks from third parties and even internal employees. Not with device authority protected data, however. Finally, the data is then mashed up by the application enablement platform, turning the secure data payloads into enriched key actionable data. This enables specific outcomes. In this scenario, the poor condition of the brake pads could trigger an alert to a car repair center that a new set of brake pads for this particular model will need to be ordered. All of this key actionable data provides a plethora of statistical insight. Again, in this scenario, vehicle manufacturers can analyze the longevity of vehicular parts. All of this data can be optimized for the end user, so a recipient of the data will be exposed to only what is needed shrinking the attack surface at the endpoint phenomenally, in contrast to traditional data protection methods. Thanks to the Device Authority platform, sensitive data can be passed throughout the cloud and amongst the Internet of Things securely and efficiently. Device Authority. Delivering trust in the Internet of Things.